We don't, we don't make mistakes. We have happy accidents. Hello, all my art ninjas, and welcome back to another edition of Art at Home with Mr. Morales. That's right. This is the time of the day when you tap into your brain power, hit your creativity to the max, and create that wonderful masterpiece. And today, because we're so close to Thanksgiving, we're going to celebrate by creating a project where we take our beautiful hands and create little turkeys. That's right. So get ready because this project is about to begin right now. So boys and girls, for today's project... Hello boys and girls, it's me, Fuego, your fire-breathing safety dragon. Because if a fire dragon can be safe, anyone can be safe. Hello Mr. Morales. Um, yeah, hi Fuego. Um, are you here to show the kids how to do the project? Mm-mm, no. No! Mm-mm-mm. Um, why not? I'm scared of turkeys. Ever since the accident. Um, Fuego, what, what, what accident? I was flying to Florida for the Dragon Convention, and out of nowhere, smack! A flying turkey crashed into me. It was horrible. Oh, oh, it, was, it was horrible. <laughs> Maybe. Okay, okay, Fuego. Uh, okay, Fuego, relax. Um, you know, Fuego, uh, I, I don't know, but I don't know if, Turkeys can fly, and even if the ones that do fly, I think they stay very close to the ground. You're calling me a liar? No, no, Fred, I'm, I'm, I mean, we can Google it if you want. What? I'm not a liar! Fred, I'm not calling you a liar. Yes, you are! Fred, I'm not calling you a liar. Maybe it was just a fat duck. <laughs> uh, Fuego, Fuego, I don't have time for this. Listen, Fuego. While you get over your turkey phobia or whatever it is, why don't I show the kids how to do the project with our, with our special guest, the Art Ninja, and then you can just watch, okay? Mm-hmm. Sound good? Mm-hmm. Okay, so why don't you tell bye to the kids, and now we'll talk to you later, okay? Bye, boys and girls. Air five, come on. Head up, head up, head up, head up. Big old dragon kiss. Bye. Okay, that was a fuego. But, uh, all right, boys and girls, time to get to the project. So for this project, we're going to need a couple of supplies. Number one, if you have construction paper, great. Even if you don't, just get white regular paper. We're going to need crayons, markers, or colored pencils. We're going to need scissors and a glue stick. The only other thing we're going to need is either a black marker, uh, a pen, or a pencil. Normally, I prefer black markers and pens only because when we're writing and or outlining, the lines are a little bit darker and a little more clear when we're cutting and things like that. But if not, a pencil will do just fine. Okay, so now we're going to have our mysterious ninja show us, right? So our, our ninja shows us a couple of different ways we could do this project. So first, our art ninja is going to show us how to do this project with construction paper. So let's take it away because that project begins right now.
so now you saw a project with construction paper. But what if you don't have construction paper? That is fine. So now we're going to show you a different problem. Well, actually the same projects, um, but with just white paper. So let's take it away as our Art Ninja begins our second project right now.
got that. So now that we know that we don't need construction paper, we can run to our next thing. And now our ninja wanted to show you just one more variation where uh, there was no cutting or gluing whatsoever. But again, it's just about using your creativity. So let's take a look at our last project right now. to your brain power, hit your creativity to the max, and create your own masterpiece. So it is time for you to do your art project. So boys and girls, the Art Ninja showed us different ways to do this project. The goal is for you to be as creative as possible, to get ideas, but you don't have to do exactly what the Art Ninja did, right? For example, one project, one sample was just a patriotic turkey. There was no cutting, there was, there was no gluing. And the other project, the second project, Right, the onion took two hands, created a turkey, and then used the, the fingertips as feathers to write things that, you know, we can all be thankful for. Family, our friends, the, the fact that we live in the United States of America. And then for the first project, the turkey, uh, the onion created a turkey by using, right, their hand, my hand, um, Fuego's hand and we created this beautiful turkey with three different size hands and you can do that by asking your mom your dad your your brother sister your grandmother maybe there's a baby that you can trace the hand either way just have fun doing the project so boys and girls i have to go but again if i don't see you happy thanksgiving um have a wonderful time with your family god bless you guys and for my students i will see you live on google classroom after we finish the project and I will, I will also leave a link to uh, um, a palette 
for this project so we can just upload all our images and share our projects together with each other. So it is time to go once again, everyone. Have an artastic day. Have an artastic time. And I'll see you later. Bye now. <laughs>